So this is solar PV based mobile battery charger. Okay. So it consists of uh, solar panel. So here you can choose uh, solar panel uh, as secure, right? We can uh, I open this model. So here you can change this one parallel string. So if you are use single model, right? The power rating will be nine watts. So recently you can uh, see the battery charger rating right normal battery charge rating so the top comes with uh, 50 watts okay uh, 50 watts 30 watts and 20 watts so based upon that things so you can change the rating also by making that parallel string numbers so if you want uh, 20 watts near 20 watts charger controller for that battery by using solar PV so then you can change this value to 2 if you change this value to 2 means ok so already the single model has 9 watts if we change to 2 means so you will get the 18 watt solar panel power that means you are going to combine 2 panel in parallel ok so that is why the power rating going to be increase so here I choose parallel string equal to 3 so uh, I send one model right so in that model so you can see that the parallel, parallel string value is 1 ok so you can change this value also so if you change this value 1 right for example I am going to change this value to 1 so once again first I stop this simulation so initially so I am going to use one series string, one uh, parallel string model then the power rating of the panel is 9 watts so the maximum current it can supply is 0.75 and then voltage will be 12 volt ok so you can see the variation of this uh, solar panel voltage and current here and then you can see the variation of battery voltage and uh, current here and then here in between that solar panel and the battery so I have used to buck and water ok so normally and solar uh, that means um, battery mobile phone having lithium ion battery with a rating of 5 volt or 3.3 volt so here I am going to consider 5 volt uh, lithium ion battery with uh, 6000 milli H uh, rated capacity battery and initial state of charge of the battery is 50 percentage I am going to consider ok so this battery going to be charged by means of the solar PV panel so now I am going to submit this one so we can see that uh, uh, in the panel voltage is around 11.12 uh, 12 volt right around 12 volt the current is from the solar panel is around 0.72 so here you can see that the panel load that means battery voltage is around 5.43 so that panel voltage so nominal voltage is 5 volt and then it can be charged up to 5.8 volt right and then this operating range for that panel that means 3.75 to 5.8 volt if it is 100 percentage that the voltage in that battery is around 5.81 if it is 0 percentage means the voltage is around 3.75 ok and then uh, the battery can discharge maximum current of 2.6 amps ok so now you can see that the current uh, given for that uh, charging current is around minus 1.4 because uh, y is minus the current direction will be is in this direction so that is why the battery current is minus if it is minus the battery charging condition ok so and also you can see the variation of that uh, PV voltage current so this is PV voltage PV current and PV power ok so this is 
battery voltage battery current charging current and state of charge so initially is a state of charge it will be 50 percent is so every second the charge will be increasing okay so this charging okay this charging is depends upon that current how much current how how much charging current is given to that battery so this is depends upon that charging current okay so here i simulated in between 0 to 60 seconds only so you can finally you will see that variation from 0 to 60 degree so you can check the uh, initially that uh, at 0 second the battery charge around 50 percent is so after 60 seconds you will get some charge right so based upon this value you can calculate for a uh, uh, what's the charging uh, uh, charge percentage after one hour okay that means so this is about 60 seconds that means one minute so you can find out the slope that means in between uh, and this 0 to 60 after the just you have to multiply it with that uh, 60 so you will get a one hour charging percentage okay so that's why you can uh, check the charging uh, time charging level for it. one hour two hours three hours okay so and also uh, here this uh, this charging uh, slope is depends upon that uh, uh, that charging current okay that means from the solar panel power right so next you can change the solar panel power rating also so by changing the solar power rating so you can see the variation of uh, charging current and also you can see the variation of uh, charging uh, soc level of the battery so depends upon the charging current also so for that i'm going to make the solar panel rating that means i'm going to use 50 watts panel okay so for that i'm going to multiply it with uh, 5 the if i mean 40 by 40 by watts panel so i'm going to use 40 by watts panel and then i'm going to simulate this model Now I use 40 watts panel. So now you can see the way. This is a panel voltage, and then you can see the panel current, right? So before it value is around only 0.7. Now you can see that panel is supplying the current of around uh, 3.8 amps. Okay. So this is you can see the PV power power will be around 45 watts. Okay. So this is charging charging voltage of the battery. So this is a charging current. Now you can see the charging current is around minus six. So and also you can see the variation of uh, charging level of the SOC when compared to we are using nine watts, right? When you use nine watts panel, the charging slope will be very charging time or charging of the battery is very slow. When you are going to use 40 watts panel, the charging of the battery is very high, right? So just you can compare that term uh, slope of both. Uh, 9 watts panel with uh, battery and then 45 watts panel with battery right so we will get some idea so i am going to i am going to simulate this model up to 60 seconds so we will check the process okay now you can see that uh, with the 30 second right the soc state of charge of battery change from 50 to 51 percentage that means within uh, 30 second it will charge one percentage that means within one minute it will going to be charged two percentage that means you are going to charge the battery by using this 40 <laughs> 45 watts panel with that uh, dc dc converter with the mbbt algorithm okay so you can charge the battery from 0 percentage to 100 percentage around 50 minutes okay within 50 minutes you can charge the battery by using this model so this is p and algorithm 
so here we are measuring that the voltage and current of the PV panel after that we are going to calculate the change in power and then change in voltage and then we have to check the change in power level if change in power is greater than zero we are going to allow this one if change in power is not less than so greater than zero and then is going to allow this logic okay so here you are going to check the condition the change in voltage if change in voltage is greater than zero right it going to uh, decrease the duty cycle by the amount of del t okay when the change in voltage is less than zero it going to allow and the, it, we are going to increase the duty cycle by the amount of delta t the same case is going to be applied here in inverse direction that means this condition is true that means it uh, increase the duty cycle if condition is false it decrease the duty cycle ok so by means of this we are going to apply the p and o algorithm so finally we will get uh, duty cycle okay so the duty cycle here we are uh, measuring the parameter of that uh, battery that mean uh, state of charge and uh, uh, battery maximum charging voltage okay so based upon this okay based upon this uh, if soc is less than 100 and then uh, the battery voltage is less than less than or equal to maximum charging voltage then uh, it allow that uh, PWM signal to the uh, converter to charge the battery. So this pulse is going to be given to the buck converter. So this converter is uh, transfer the power from that uh, solar panel to battery to charge the battery. So this is the working of that uh, solar BB based to mobile battery charger. Thank you.